This mirror that's installed here that we have to remove was installed over top of the, the plugs. So this is fun. What we're going to do is we're just going to bend them, place them back inside again. My hope is that we can lift the mirror out of position without causing this to shorten out. <sighs> so there's three basic ways to install mirrors. One is a surface mount screw clip. You've seen the little plastic things and they got a screw head. The other one is you can use a, uh, like a two-sided tape and silicone and you can just stick it and glue it. This one here is it's a moving bracket. It's on a, it's on a track. And so you can take the tops off. And then the glass basically just falls forward. And this one, they've used a combination of adhesives as well, probably because they have this cut around there. So the idea is you loosen the glass and then you can lift it and pull it off the plugs. Remove the mirror without destroying it. This broken glass is a pain in the butt to clean up. There we go. I think we're clear. Now, just a word to the wise. Always wear gloves. I prefer to do this kind of work by myself and have the second guy around to open doors and close doors for me. If something bad happens here, I'm going to know the minute it happens. I'm going to step aside. This is not safety glass. This kind of stuff here can cause personal injury, so. Nice and careful. So we've got another mirror to remove here. And this is the same clip system as we demonstrated last time. The last time was a really large mirror and you'll notice that it came off without much resistance. So we're hoping to get the same kind of effect this time. So like once again, we just pop up the clips and <laughs> it doesn't want to come. Ugh. Now, you can realize I used a lot of force there. Glass is a lot stronger than you think. They've obviously done some silicone backing here. Let's try sliding it. There we go. Now it's released. So let's go take a look and see what it is that these monkeys actually ended up doing here. Okay. Lots of this black two-sided adhesive goop for mirrors. And then a great big dollop of silicone as well. <sighs> Don't ask me why. Folks, if you're using the clips, by all means, let gravity do the work for you. You don't need to get creative and use all this sticky crap. You're just risking an accident for somebody later on. Remember, if you want to learn more, just subscribe to our channel, Ottawa Design and Build here on YouTube.